Hello and welcome to today's Kerbal Space Program video. We're going to be doing re-entry testing on the shuttle we brought in the last video. So I downloaded some mods and I'll just remove these parts. There. Okay, so for this vehicle, we'll just use reaction wheels instead of RCS for to help us with the re-entry. I'll just add a couple more reaction moves to this. There's no need to worry about running out of electricity because we could use infinite fuel for now but later we'll fix that problem. I just use the debug menu to get into orbit. To plan this, you just need to put a maneuver node over the Mon arc and run retrograde, retrograde to get about over that place, that section there. And just pull progress a bit to the, to, to the right of that. So it's about time we start the boring. There. In case you are wondering why the plumes look nice, I'm using wheel plumes or wheel plumes. The mod link is in the description. And I uh, physical time. Now I finished with that burn, we could point pro grade. And there. I'll skip to when we reach the atmosphere. Now it's re-entry time and just pitch up to about 20 degrees to 30 degrees. And just keep this stable position and depending on whether you're going off track, increase the pitch. And if you see that increasing the pitch is adding too much lift, you could move to the side and start doing an S turn, which is yawing to the right, then yawing to the left. So I'm just going to speed up till we get closer to the runway.
working. And in case at this stage here, over 1,000 meters was set over the mountains and you're under 27,000 meters, don't try to pull on any high G's. If not, you might flip out. And if you're on approach to the runway, you may want to bring out the air brake. But be careful as if your speed is getting really low, the air brake will make you spin out. Then you land short of the runway. Getting closer and closer to the runway, so I bring out the air brake, and you could turn the deploy angle up to 38 degrees. Now we just need to glide down and try to lose enough speed before landing. So I just bank hard and pitch up in that direction, so we both change direct change the speed of craft and the attitude. Move right a bit and touch down. Breaks on, deploy drill, shoot, and just wait till the space shuttle stops. Oops, I need to turn the front brake up to 200% so we don't overrun on the runway. Yay, and we've come to a complete stop. Please remember to like and subscribe. And any of your suggestions in the comments, I'll reply. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. But before then, we need to see the purpose.